Recently, the Uganda National Bureau of Standards found 6,000 defective meters after conducting tests, an issue that has caused panic to power users. However, the Electricity Regulatory Authority says the said meters do not pose any danger because they are not in service. But it's important to clarify that uh, those were meters that are not yet installed in homes or other premises. Um, also to note is that before, before meters are installed, they have to meet a standard that is set by the UNBS. So if any meters do not pass the test, then they are not allowed to progress to our distribution network or they could be taken back to the manufacturers for corrective action, then they are retested. When they pass that test, then they, uh, they are put back onto the network. Utility firm Meme, one of the nine distributors licensed by the Electricity Regulatory Authority, have however distanced themselves from the 40 meters. There are other uh, distributors, be, this, be them small, but they are also, they are also using prepayment. And UNB is on, is on record to have come out to clarify that the meters that they were, that the, that the meters in question did not belong to Meme, they belonged to the other suppliers. That I need to get that out clear in the first place. Uh, secondly, Meme meters conform to all standards set by, by, by UNBS. Be them pre-shipment, uh, pre that's before they, they come into the country, they have been, they have been, they have been, they have been certified and we have satisfaction, okay? We have certificates for all our meters. The Uganda National Bureau of Standards Executive Director was contacted for a comment on this issue. He declined to speak. This is not the first time the issue of 40 prepaid meters is coming out, with consumers of electricity having previously complained to utility farm Umeme of high power costs and cheating. So the story about defective prepaid meters according to the Electricity Regulatory Authority is half-baked and are calling on power consumers not to panic. The regulator says they are piecing together information to find the facts on the same. The Uganda National Bureau of Standards and Utility Firm Umeme earlier on in the day promised a second statement which we are still waiting for. Malcolm Sime, NTV Business. Kampala.